Today I'll be taking a quick unboxing first look at these amazing Ahsoka Tano sunglasses by Diff Eyewear. So if you love Ahsoka and getting stylish for summer, stay tuned. Hello there. Welcome to the Kessel Runway Show. Hello there, welcome to the Kessel Runway and today I have a new arrival from Diff Eyewear. So I'm super excited about this one, so I'm just going to get straight into it. I have opened the box um, just to make sure that it arrives safely, but we'll get straight into it. I like how small and compact Diff send their items. This is obviously sunglasses, it's a pretty small box, it's come all the way from the US, um, so very glad that it arrived safely. So inside we can see we've got some branding and it says thank you for making a difference that's one of their sort of slogans and then inside we can see the Star Wars sunglass case so as you might be able to guess from the colors and the design this is the Ahsoka sunglasses that came out from the recent mini Mandalorian collection so you can see she's got her Tegruta sort of pattern here in this shiny black against the matte black finish and we've got blue text here so I'm super super excited to get into this one we've got some Orabesh down this down the front here with the Lucasfilm copyright there we've got sort of some more of the bottom edge of her uh, Montreal tails there so I'm just super excited to jump straight into this so I know that they do some very cool um, boxes for their, oh, which end, I'll do this one, um, for their sunglasses, all the Star Wars sunglasses come with a uh, neat Star Wars box, so we have these sunglasses here in a plastic Ziploc bag, and inside we also have the uh, sunglasses case, so this one has crossed white lightsabers um, because this is a later generation of Ahsoka from the Mandalorian where she has her white sabers and then again we have the blue so I think the blue and white really ties in well with Ahsoka's uh, Montrals obviously they are blue and white so inside we have this gorgeous sort of burgundy coloring which fits very well with the Mandalorian theme and as we open up we can see here that the sabers are fully printed on the front of the case so when you open it up and form the full triangle here I'll just get the sides opened up so it's one of these ones that comes flat but then when you sort of build it it creates a lovely triangle shaped case and we can see it says Lucasfilm so it keeps your sunglasses nice and safe so when we fully close the lid we can see that the white lightsabers line up to have a full graphic of her uh, lightsabers there. Now these are of course her sort of Clone Wars era ones, not the fulcrum lightsabers that we see later, um, which is a little bit interesting. I thought they might have gone with those ones um, for the Mandalorian, but I know that these ones are really iconic and fans are a fan. Uh, fans love those ones. So we can see that it's got the Mandalorian printed there, um, just sort of a slight white print on this sort of suede like lining which is a really fun touch obviously this is a licensed product and the lid snaps closed really nicely so I always like the fact that they come with these nice cases I have a few other Star Wars sunglasses from a range of different brands and they don't always come with really good cases so also inside the case we have a Star Wars diff branded cleaning cloth another little fun addition so as you can see it's just a small little cleaning cloth it's got sort of the classic hyperspace lines and it says Star Wars X Diff and the copyright down so that's another little great little inclusion I know that you can buy sort of like a little cleaning kit little accessories and things like that from Diff but do know that that does actually come with each pair of Star Wars sunglasses so onto the main event we can see that they are all wrapped up nicely in a ziplock bag or kept nice and safe this is my first pair of essentially plastic sunglasses from Diff. I have a couple of others from their Star Wars range which are all metal frames so I'm very excited to see these in person. So we've got a whole array of plastic packaging here which um, 
keeps it very nice and safe. Okay, so we get, we can get a, a hint there at the side arms, that gorgeous orbit inlaid in this metal section. And then again, on the same on the other side. So you can just make that out there when the light catches it. I love the Ouroboros touches. Uh, Diff do quite a lot of Ouroboros uh, lettering on their Star Wars products. So I'll just take that wrapping off and then we can see the glasses properly now. So this is what they call sort of like a Togruta tortoise shell. So it's like a tortoise shell sort of but instead of it being sort of animal colors browns and and yellows this one is a Togruta colored so we see we have sort of a blue with darker blue stripes in it which obviously are inspired by Ahsoka's Montrals which is why they've gone with the blue on the box and things like that and it has a sort of a warmer uh, warmer tone on the glasses you can't quite see it in this light um, in the sunlight you'd be able to see that it's more of a sort of a, a brown a warmer color which obviously is like Ahsoka's face she has a very orange toned skin so that's going to sort of form that color you can kind of make out the color there so it's um, a great fit so it's kind of bringing in that face detail for the um, for the eyes the lenses. We have a small diff text on the top lens which I'm not sure how well that's going to catch but one of the details that I particularly like are these little diamond studs here on the sort of temples of the of the glasses. I'll just get that to focus there. You can just see that sort of metal diamond shape which is kind of taken from um, various elements of Ahsoka's costumes. Her headband that she wears in the Mandalorian tends to have those sort of diamond shapes. She has diamond shapes on her fulcrum era lightsabers as well, which I like just those little touches. Obviously this isn't really strongly blue, white and orange like some Ahsoka Tano merch. Um, we don't have hints of burgundy much. Obviously we've got the sort of amber tones for her face, but we have got this lovely sort of um, Ourobesh down the side which without translating it exactly I'm pretty sure based on the number of characters says Ahsoka Tano I will confirm that later you can just see so anybody that is familiar with Ourobesh or will just recognize the text Ahsoka Tano written on Ourobesh will be able to read it along the side and I like that sort of subtle touching so one of the things that this uh, particular lens um, set advertised was that it has a special uh, breath reveal that if you breathe on the lens it will reveal a sort of little hidden symbol or text. Now the Ahsoka ones um, according to the website will show the Jedi symbol when you breathe on the lens so just in my eyes, looking at it here, I can't see a single thing printed on it, which is kind of interesting. I th was wondering how evident it would be in its natural state. Um, i just noticing here, it has a little text that says Ahsoka Tano on the um, arm here, if the camera will pick up on that. It's very faint, just, just there. I don't know if that's going to show, but it says Ahsoka Tano there, so you've got that little branding where you can see it, and then on the other side it has is the uh, the Lucasfilm text here written on the inside because this is obviously a licensed one so I'm just gonna breathe on the lenses because I don't know how this is gonna quite work <sighs> okay I don't really see anything actually I don't know which side it's actually supposed to be supposed to be on <sighs> hmm I don't really see anything actually. It might need it might need a fair amount of heat to actually activate. I don't know if it's like condensation or heat, but it's definitely very subtle. So I'm gonna have to play around with that a little bit and see how well that shows up because it's definitely not evident to my eyes under this lighting. Obviously this is a bit um, indoor, uh, bright spotlights, and I can't see anything. But yeah, I. Besides the point, I, I, that was just sort of like a fun party trick um, detail, even if they were plain lenses, I still really wanted these. Obviously there has been a 
absolute torrent of Ahsoka Tano apparel and merchandise coming out in the last few months but rather than get yet another t-shirt and I do love my Ahsoka Tano t-shirts um, I wanted something that was a little bit different something that I wasn't going to find many places and I just thought Ahsoka Tano sunglasses that's just interesting it's coming up to summer here in New Zealand um, you just basically can't go outside without sunglasses in summer here we have uh, you know, not the hottest summers. I know there's a, quite a few places around the world, but we uh, we we live we live at the beach in New Zealand. We're completely surrounded by water. We spend a lot of the time at the beach. So classic New Zealand summers means that you're going to be spending time at the beach with your sunglasses. So I like having a good number of pairs in my collection um, to match different outfits. So I'm just super super excited that I have a Sokotano sunglasses. I hope the colors are showing well on camera because they are just super cool. I love this colorway and I'm really enjoying the sturdiness of this plastic. Um, I don't know exactly what plastic it is um, but it feels really sturdy and they have lovely metal hinges because of this metal bar here and on the inside it has a lovely metal hinge. So these clothes, um, they've got like a good grip. They're not uh, they don't swing loose. See, I can like close it um, and on the other side there as well. So I love the feel of these. They feel like a decent level quality. And yeah, I'm just super, super excited. These ones cost a little bit more than some of the others in the range. Um, the, first, the first collection was a little bit cheaper than these subsequent releases, but to me, they are totally worth it. I mean, how perfect are these to topping off any Star Wars outfit or an Ahsoka outfit or just incognito. I love the aura best touches, but then the colors just feel really Ahsoka to me. So that's just so very exciting. I've been wanting these for a while. While they took their sweet time arriving in the international mail but as an awesome uh, little perk diff do offer international shipping for free if you order over a certain amount and most of their Star Wars sunglasses actually hit that level so as an international fan the shipping was a little slow but that's due to other factors that's nothing to do with diff that's just international mail at the moment but these did come shipped for free which is absolutely awesome I love it when a company especially a Star Wars licensed company uh, does things that really benefit the international fans because you know everything costs more for us shipping uh, customs uh, just the exchange rate and everything like that so I'm super excited and very happy to support a company making awesome products like this so I hope you enjoyed my little unboxing I'm gonna have full proper photos and I'm gonna see if I can try and get that symbol to kind of trigger um, see if I can capture that on camera for you guys later but even so I love these I'm gonna be rocking these so much over summer I hope you enjoyed this quick video thank you so much for watching and may the force be with you if you enjoyed this video go ahead and give it a like check out our other videos and subscribe for alerts about new uploads thanks for watching and may the force be with you